Hi guys. <laughs> I mean, would you look at this view? <sighs> oh. <clears throat> Mab and I have been spending the last couple days south of Los Angeles and um, I think we were in San Clemente, I think. We might have been further south, I think, but I don't know. I don't know where we were. <laughs> Welcome to my life. But Mab is still down there and I had to come up to LA for a casting today. So uh, I've been here dealing with traffic and Los Angeles and work and I'm kind of sick of it so I have been looking at Google Maps for the last like 10 minutes and I found a place up in the Pine Mountains which is like two and a half hours from here whenever I get overwhelmed being somewhere I tend to like pick point on a map and just dip out and go for it <laughs> so uh, that's what I'm gonna do today I think I'm just gonna finish this little clip and then I'm gonna get in the driver's seat and just head there. And that's as far as my plan go globe. And that is as far as my plan goes. So uh, I don't know if Mav will come. It's probably gonna be like a four hour drive for him. So I don't know, uh, it might just be me. For now it's just me. So I'm gonna take you along for the ride and you'll see what happens. I pulled over because there's some beautiful shit going on over here. <laughs> uh, yeah, so I'm gonna go. There are some like rocks this way that I wanna go sit on and hang out. So we're gonna see if I can get there. Is there a path? No. I don't know. Ooh, can I get down here? I'm gonna walk down here. Okay. <laughs> okay, I don't know if you can see this, but there are so many noceums around right now. They're driving me nuts. <laughs> Made it. <laughs> I'm not in very good shape, <laughs> but uh, I climbed down a valley and then up a valley and up with some rocks. And now I'm on some rocks. <laughs> and this is the view I get. I'm pretty happy. I think I'm gonna sit here for a little bit and rest my soul. Ooh, that's bright. Wow. I'm gonna shut you guys off now because I'm gonna be here alone. See you later, gators. I just found like a flat route, so I think this path might be a lot easier <laughs> to get back to my car than the one I took, but I can't see anything. <laughs> this is why I wanted to park.
would be really nice if I had a rear camera. So I'm actually using my like sheer curtains for once to defend against the uh, little gnats that have been all over the place. So obviously there's like a few getting in, but um, it really, it really has not been too bad. Um, obviously these don't cover the whole thing, but it's better than nothing. So I don't know. I feel like I've gotten people saying like, Oh, that's just unrealistic. You'll get bugs in your van all the time. Uh, I really haven't had a problem with bugs. If it's super buggy out, usually I'll just close my doors. Uh, tonight, it's not mosquitoes, it's like gnats. So I'm not actually, as I speak, there comes a mosquito. I think it's about time to close these. God damn it. Why you have to ruin it? I was gonna say tonight it's just gnats. So I wasn't too worried about it if they got in, but um, now that I'm seeing mosquitoes, I think I might have to shut them. But they're like, I couldn't, they're cute. <laughs> That's all I really care about, right? Um, I don't know, I really only saw that one mosquito, so I hope if I start seeing more, I'll close them, I guess, but that's my solution for bug netting. I feel like you could also get like a screen thing that you could like fit to the corners of your doors. I just haven't ever had a problem with it, so I have just not worried about it too much. <laughs> I, uh, I don't normally record this kind of stuff, but, um, I am living a really good life. <laughs> I'm so happy. And I'm just laying here in bed with like my food and like just watching the sunset. And I'm just completely alone out here. I don't, I don't even know why I'm recording it. I just like, I'm like really overwhelmed. I guess. Um. I just wish everybody would go out and do things that they want to do and get to experience moments like this. Um, I guess there's something really beautiful about being completely alone and experiencing something completely alone. <clears throat> no, I don't know. I don't know what I was planning on saying, but um, I think I'm gonna stop recording now. Found me. Hey, boy. Hey, boy. That one's a freaking windy, huh? That was a trail. <laughs> Didn't you get lost? I almost fell off the cliff a couple times. Yeah. Yeah, I was <laughs> flying. Dude. Yeah. I'm no. <laughs> you missed a hell of a sunset. I'm sure I did. I have photos still. You can remember that? You know why I was late? Why? You stopped and got a burger? Well, that and. But the reason why I got a burger. I rear-ended someone. Very nice. Come on. Good morning. Um, last night, Maverick showed up, has his truck out there. Um, I'm not actually sure where he is right now. I think he might be peeing. The view is just as pretty as it was last night. 
I think we're gonna make breakfast and then maybe go hike around. Mev and I went on a hike. I'm laying on a rock and he's up at the top of the mountain with his eyes closed. <laughs> Get down here so we can keep walking. We're in Los Padres Los National Padres. Forest <laughs> and um the mountain that we're on is Pine Mountain. The area where we slept last night on Pine Mountain is Point Reyes. And technically, I think we're in a campsite. The area has campsites that you can reserve and pay for. But I found a pull-off pull that had a very beautiful view. So I didn't feel too bad about it because like there were actually like marked off campsites that we and just didn't use. But yeah, so I guess if you want to come here, um, there are campsites, you could just pitch a tent. I'm not sure where you would pay to do that. Did you see anything? There was uh, those boxes, I think, at the beginning. Like, oh, are there? Okay. Okay, but so. I think you can also probably go online. Online. Places like this have like online stuff. Okay. Like, I don't know for sure. <laughs> I wasn't sure if there was like an actual checkpoint where you like you could pay for yeah, it. No, I didn't see one. But there's also other pull-offs like further down the mountain. You just don't get as high of a view, which I really, it was a windy road. Get. Like it took me. It's an super windy. Hour and a half to get like thirty miles. Anyway, we're gonna go find a little town. I think I think I drove through a town. We're gonna go get some work done. So we're gonna drive down the mountain. We'll probably stop at some other little places if we see anything cool. Yeah. All right. Goodbye. Very nice. Your what? My key got stuck in this thing. Oh my god. In what? What is that? It's the lock to get the fucking... <laughs> Here, I have your spear. So we're uh, on the side of the road <laughs> because somebody got himself into some trouble. Who is that? Someone? Me. I'm, yeah. I'm say, it, say it louder for the people in the back. Uh, it's me. <laughs> what happened? Uh, don't, wow. don't. Uh, moral of the story is. Don't get distracted with stuff that's in your backseat while you're driving. No, probably never and, uh, a good idea. I feel like you should have known that. I thought my water was leaking in the back and uh... Not important. No, not <laughs> important at all. Luckily, the ranger station was right down the road. I had gotten ahead of him, so I had like not realized that he was in trouble. She, she had straight up <laughs> ditched me. I was sitting here for 30 you, minutes by myself. I literally, I was like, he's just fucking around, isn't he? He's like stopped to like take photos or something. And so I like kept driving. I went down to the ranger station. And that's where like the road was forking. So I was like, I'm just gonna sit here and wait till he's done fucking around with whatever. I was like right so I was behind. Sitting, you. I was sitting <laughs> at the ranger station. And I was like, oh, I'm gonna have to go back up and like make him stop taking photos or whatever he's doing. So I drove back up, and then and I then felt you, bad. Then you saw my car just destroyed. And then the rangers came up and helped him change the tires. <laughs> and we're gonna go to Ojai, which is not the direction we were gonna go, but we're going to Ojai, and we're going to. 
fix up some tires. Get some, get some tires. Oh, here, show, luckily, show, show the kids this. Luckily, I have my van. Damn. <laughs> I mean, that's fucked. Damn. Yeah. How do you even do that? That's a rock, dude. Jeez. Luckily, he has me, and we don't travel in the same car together. Thank you. Yeah. I should charge you. This is my towing fee. I'll pay you later. All right, get that thing in the car. <laughs> okay, guys, it has been a long day. It's like four, I think, five, four, I don't know. Um, but all of this happened at like noon. Now we're heading, I don't actually know where, but I think we're both tired. Our day is kind of gone, so Mav is dirty. <laughs> He's been laying on the ground with his head in the dirt, so I think we both need to go find an anytime fitness. Okay, so Mav and I just drove up to, where's the chessboard? I don't know, dude. Oh, oh is it in my really bag? Yeah. yeah. Um, so Mav and I just drove up to this lake dirt road pull off lookout thing in Castic Lake uh, area. Uh, Castic. Is it? Is yeah. that how you say it? Lake Castic. Unless everybody's gonna just tell me I'm wrong now. <laughs> anyway, we've been here before. Well, yeah, the only place where there is an anytime. Yeah, this was the only place where there was an anytime where we needed a shower. Yeah. Now we're gonna play chess because that's all we ever do, always, all the time. Mav and I are making pancakes with a very nice view in the background. Um, do you want me to make coffee? I'm gonna make coffee. That smells so good. Sorry, that one's kind of ugly. Pumpkin, huh? Yeah. I forgot about that. Maverick's truck. I won this cooking competition. our last little day together. Mav is going fishing with a friend tomorrow in San Diego, so he's leaving. That happens when you're driving in the van. Um, but Mav is going down to San Diego tomorrow to go fishing with a friend, so this is kind of our last day together for the next couple days. And so we're just gonna go to Pyramid Lake and we're gonna have like a little picnic, probably rent a boat, and I'll take you along.
Oops. Uh, I didn't really film like an outro. I kind of, our day yesterday ended, brought the boat back, hung out on the beach, and then the park closed at 5.45. We went and showered, and then we drove to Huntingdon Beach, I think, and slept there for the night. So now we are here, and we've just had a lazy morning. We went to the 603 coffee house down by the beach and had breakfast and coffee. And now it is back to work time and reality. Uh, I think we're both gonna edit today. Hopefully I'll get this up and yeah, that's it. That's all I have for you. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video. It was just like a little small peek into our fun days and what van life is all about. See you later, guys.